Hello, sweet souls. Happy Sunday, March 19th. And I wanted to come on and do your second reading. We're going to call on St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender anyone sending ill will. Your thought, order, action toward myself or the viewer. We're going to call on the Holy Spirit, angel, saints, spirit guides, and ancestors, and ask for a message for your greater good. So the first thing I want to tell you guys, your life, although it's been really difficult and you have gone through a lot of karmic cycles, God wants you to know that divine timing is at play. For many of you, you're getting very overwhelmed and you're getting frustrated and you feel like you're losing hope or faith. And God wants you to know that things are happening behind the scenes that you don't see. The universe is putting in a lot of work on your behalf, clearing out people, places, or things that are not in alignment with you, people that misrepresent themselves um, so that they can get you in uh, divine masculine, divine feminine energy. The only thing that they're asking from you right now is to, one, be patient, to surrender control, fear, worry, complete surrender, and speak your truth. The universe is working with you in ways that you just cannot even imagine. They also want you to embrace the transformation, embrace, embrace the changes that are occurring in your life without fear of failure. Without trying to control the timeline, okay? And I know it's hard, especially when you've been through so much. You know, but just because you're not seeing it doesn't mean that they're not working on things because they are, they are, they're removing so many people, places or things that are not meant to be in your life. Yeah. They want you to love yourself, pour into your cup, really love you the way you have loved everyone in your past that didn't appreciate you, that drained you. Love yourself. Give yourself that love. They're saying, you will have victory. Victory will be yours. I didn't know if I showed you the Queen of Cups. Victory is going to be yours. And they don't want you to worry. You're being elevated in every way by you loving yourself by you pouring into your own cup, cup, by you setting boundaries with other people who don't, don't give you the love and respect that you deserve. You nurturing your mind, body, and spirit. Spirit, you are promised victory, promised stability, financial security. You know, sometimes we're tested. Sometimes God will test us to see, do we have ultimate trust and faith. You know, say that you have an online shop and you are, you know this is what you're meant to do. You are advertising your goods and all of a sudden it's been really low. Your sales have been really low. God is testing you. Are you going to stay committed and devoted? Are you going to continue to trust and have faith? and believe that he is going to meet all of your needs. Not only meet your, your needs, but exceed them. Or are you just gonna give up? Give up on what you're guided to do because you're in a period where it's not as abundant as you think it should be. Sometimes it's just a test. Yeah. This is all about God, the universe, the angels, and saints restoring balance in your life. Putting things in order the way they should be. It's good karma for you. All right? Your creative endeavors, they want you to take your focus off of things that did not work out for you. People, jobs, whatever relationships that didn't work out for you and focus on your creativity. Focus on your creation. What can you create? What are you being guided to create? It's going to lead to victory. It's going to 
definitely the victory. God's here to ensure it. If you will surrender complete control to him and stop fussing and worrying about your bank account. And yes, I know we need money to live. I get it. But when you say, I trust in you, that you will provide all that I need and then some. And you start putting out the energy that you are already abundant. I don't care if you have $2 in your account. God is going to make sure that happens, okay? God is also leading your divine partner to you. I can't. King to the Queen of Pentacles. God is guiding a divine partnership. And he doesn't want you getting stuck in your own mind thinking you can't do something because of the programming from your past. That's fear and fear. It doesn't exist. Fear is, is an illusion. Why can't you do it? There's nothing that says you can't achieve whatever you set your mind to. There you are. The lady or man of luxury. Standing on your own, proud and confident, where you probably, in the past, didn't think that you had the strength to be in this energy. But God isolated you so that you could prove to yourself you could be independent. You could be, be this proud, confident energy. I don't know why I'm getting emotional. God's protecting you. He's protecting everything that you do. He watches over you completely. Every second of every moment. You will no longer be abandoned or rejected. You will no longer be in poverty. Now, you're going to be in your power. Proud and confident and driven despite all those that went against you. Yeah. Because moving forward, this is fast action. You are going to have enough to save. You will be able to save money, invest in whatever you want to invest in. Peace is being restored. And for many of you, you're relocating. God will bless you. You will be taken care of financially. He doesn't want you to worry. He just wants you to surrender. Now, you're learning to come into union with your higher self, to trust your intuition, to trust God, and embrace the new version of you, which is the Empress. Knowing how amazing you are. being in your high vibration and loving everything about you. For many of you, you're going to get an exciting message. This is about a new opportunity. It's going to come in quick and it's going to lead to victory and it's something that you have prayed and you have wished for. Don't be in your head when it comes in. Give thanks and gratitude because you do deserve it. is being restored and that's the truth victory will be yours and new doors will open up for you okay all right guys this is the message i have for you i love you have an amazing day bye bye